Fonnie Willis out here trying to do what white men do. Mm. They put their mistresses in places. Mm. We can't do that. And by we, I mean black women. Black men, some black men do it. A black woman ain't ever going to be able to do it. I ain't saying it's right, but we're not. I heard Clarence Thomas was doing We have to things. be. Come on now. His wife is a whole fucking traitor. She funded. She threw money in on the insurrection. Nobody's talking about it. Right. Um, it's crazy. Now, my, my secret hope would be that Jack Smith has got some investigations going there. But he's right now after the big fish. You get that big fish, you get everybody else. I'm telling you, everybody else. Everybody who is associated with that needs to go to jail. I ain't satisfied with just Trump going to jail. Everybody needs to go to jail. That needs to be in jail. But this situation, this is, <laughs> I cannot believe she did this. And then got out and, and then got out and tried to defend his credentials. The man I, I think was a, an ambulance chaser. I don't know. You know what they call ambulance chaser? Had no litigation experience. Hit chiropractor, run up them hours, get them checks. No litigation experience. And you made him the special prosecutor in this case. Has had no time, has not had so much as a minute, as my understanding, prosecuting any cases. This ain't no OJT opportunity. Hmm. So he's billing the county... He's billing for what? What, is, what work is he actually doing as special prosecutor? Does he have deliverables that demonstrate um, discovery, information, securing witnesses? What has he been doing for that big chunk of money? Because right now... What do you think he's been doing? I know what he's been doing. <laughs> <laughs> hey! I know what he's been doing. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> That's what he's been doing. Now listen. We can't play maybe, these games that these other folks be playing. Maybe there's some work products we don't know about. <laughs> I don't know. But this case, it puts an unnecessary specter on her executing this um, task. The enormity of it. The significance of this this case is now running second chariot to who she's sleeping with. Wow. Or who bought what plane ticket to go on some kind of little whatever they was out there doing. Now, now the story is not the story anymore. Now she's the story. Now she's the story. The trial is not the trial. Back on her heels. The, 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 everything oh. now oh. is... You know, the prosecution is on the defense. <laughs> and what I know, and here's how I see it. If you are not divorced, you are married. Now, paperwork's in, apparently. Paperwork's in. So whatever the process is, whatever grown folks are doing, whatever. The, I, I. But the minute you brought your boo thing into this case and made them the special prosecutor on this case, when all evidence points to him being sorely inadequate to do that job, they went, comparison, they went and found Jack Smith from the Hague who has prosecuted war crimes and other corporate espionage, corporate fraud, those kinds of fucking cases is the special prosecutor for the federal government. And now you got Chuck Wade over here <laughs> as a special prosecutor for election fraud, blah, blah, blah. You know, so it, it, what? You made a good point. The magic stick has derailed the historical moment. The sister was going to go down Ow. in history. I wondered when we was going to bring this up. You know, <laughs> the sister has gone down in history for all the wrong reasons now. All for some pain. And it's crazy. Everyone's cheering, saying, you know what? This is a big case. This is a big deal. Um, everything that we think we see Trump as and doing is now what everyone can say, and you're the same thing. Prosecuting. If you are prosecuting the president of the United States of America, 
How is that not the thing you're fucking focused on until the task is done? I, that's the part I don't get. When I'm on something, when I'm on one, I'm on that thing until I am done. I'm not out here. I ain't trying to lay on no beach. I, ain't, I, I got work to do. I am prosecuting the president of the United States of America. What you getting on a plane to go do with that dude? Were you going to go find some witnesses? Look, were you, what were you doing? And so it turns into this entire, uh, it is embarrassing. It is dereliction of duty. How this many, was derelict. How many lives does Trump have? Like if you were playing a hand... <laughs> If you were playing they called him Teflon Don since the 80s. If They've you were been calling him. And you were Donald <laughs> Trump. And you're about to be deposed and you're about to blah, blah, blah. And you're looking at your hand and you're like, run it. They ran a poll in New Hampshire asking um, pollsters or uh, uh, constituents that would a conviction disqualify Trump as president? And over 50%, maybe 57% said it would not. He said he could shoot someone in the middle of Times Square. So we now live in a country that has, has a former president <laughs> as a convicted, not convicted, excuse me, an indicted um, president over this very process that he endeavors to participate in. It, why would you want to if you don't think it's going to be fair? But he is. And the only reason he's trying to do it is so that he can stop some of these convictions, so he can stop some of these um, court cases. Because a sitting president, will boop, 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 right? Well, Bill Barr put a stop to that. Hey, I mean, you break a crime. <laughs> you make a crime, break the law. Why in the hell shouldn't you be? But here we are. So she had, I think, of our time, the most significant function of our time. Yes in our history, in our political process, in our democracy, the, she had it. She still has it. Now, they haven't taken it away from her yet. Oh, they're going to take it. But had that. Not, not, she's done. She had it. But, but she, 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 she's look. done like that sister who was running Harvard. Oh, God. You know, they got a way of paying for it. There was a sister that was running Harvard. It was like, I guarantee you. I don't how, think that how happened. How long did it take uh, Art to happened. resign? That sister it will got, be resigning in the next few days. Uh, we'll see. But there's an arrogance there. Uh, so, well, but what? So, but you had of our time. Yeah. You had the single most significant task of our time. And you get derailed by somebody else's husband that you have appointed a special prosecutor. Jerry, we can't hear you in the mic. <laughs> you can pull that mic over there so we can. Yes. And so the word on the street is that his yet to be ex wife is the one who pointed at all this. Now, once this co defendant She's brought it up. To. She pull, start pulling some threads like, is this why my man is trying to divorce me? Who knows what happened, right? My point is this. Why are we fucking talking about it? Because you, no, you decided with this of our time, the most significant thing happening in this era, we had her down in Georgia. We had the DA up in, and she wearing them out in New York. They tried to do the same thing to her. Accuse her of some shit. And that, that didn't go anywhere. That didn't stick. S sticking on her, though. Sticking on Fonnie Willis. Huh. You think, could this just be an accusation? Is all this alleged? The judge has unsealed <laughs> the divorce work, paperwork. This, uh, this man is going to be deposed next week. So the only thing working in her favor right now is that the judge put a stay on her deposition until after his deposition so that he could purpose whether or not she had anything to offer that could be helpful that was not already disclosed or discovered in his divorce uh, um, Proceed. case proceedings. Yeah, that's it. That's uh. it. So... Um, 
So right now she's got she's got some runway at least till next week after his deposition, and, and then depending upon what he says, she may or may not be deposed. How long before she resigns? Because she can't stand in front of the bench with a straight face. Any, it, it's a distraction now. She that. is the story. I said a lot. I said a lot of is. words for distraction. So you had the thing of our time, and now you're a distraction. And so now you have to get in check with your ego, I guess, if you're Miss Willis, and decide whether or not you think you can push through this distraction and prosecute this case. And I'm going to tell you that she can't. And I'm going to tell you Miss Wilson ain't in control of them, them, them decisions. Then they're at all. So now, this is where I'm going with this. So the Attorney General, not of the United States of Georgia, he's going to have to intervene. And so whether or not he reassigns her, because they do that sometimes, right? they reassign you to shit, um, and appoint someone else as special prosecutor to exit. So maybe she doesn't lose her job as D district attorney, but she damn sure ain't going to get reelected. She ain't going to be on this case. And then it's going to sound no, like No, it's going to be a gonna, special prosecutor. It's going to sound like this, the great Leanne Wheeler. Okay. I'm a distraction. I'm out. Exactly. <laughs> the, it, the that end. press conference is going to be about this long. How are you doing? Donald J. Trump is not above the law. However, um, this has this situation has become a distraction, right. and it's bigger than anything other than Trump. Um, I pray that's Asta what la happens. Vesta. I pray that's what happens. That's what's going to happen. And I sure hate it because I wanted to see her see this through. We wanted to see a black superwoman hero. Yes. This was our Wakanda moment. Everybody's standing there like this. Now we're standing there like, damn. Over what was assuredly some mediocre pain. <laughs> I have no doubt. I have no doubt. It was, I mean, what are you doing? Uh. Ooh, so I don't know. We'll see. Donald Trump is doing well in the polls, and he's killing them in... <laughs> In the primaries. Can we talk he, about... I mean, he's, he's killing them, you know, along the trail. He won't debate. Uh, DeSantis is like, I'm out. Donald J. Trump will be the Republican nominee. He will be the Republican nominee. And, and, but can and we talk Biden about? be worried? I, listen, no. Shut up, Drew. No, no, he shouldn't. Because I, I am confident there are things happening in the cut to undermine that. So here's what you do. If you're a Republican that's kind of got that, I got to support him because I don't want him on my helmet, um, you still go into the poll and vote for Nikki Haley. You still, so, so I don't see, I, I don't see a, a, a um, I don't see a scenario where he is not the Republican nominee. But um, that said, she doesn't drop out of that race until South Carolina. I need you to wrap it up with Fannie Willis. Okay, sorry, man. Nutshell. I went on a whole time. Nah, no, no, nah, I want to I get your thoughts and how this thing ends and how long the before attorney we hear general, her resignation. Yeah, the attorney general of, of Georgia is going to have to intervene, appoint a special prosecutor, take her off this case. She has become a distraction. Courtesy would say she gets to say, I'm stepping aside. But you got to oh. know these conversations are happening already on right, the back right, channel. Right. We just don't know yet how it's going to be presented. But there is no way she can prosecute this case without being a distraction, right. without calling into question her judgment. I have no question that I don't, I, that she knows her job. I have no doubt she's a phenomenal lawyer. She but she so did well. this. And it ain't for me to forgive her. I don't have a heaven or hell to put her in, but I sure am mad about it. Because she, of our time, we had this president who's a mess, who did all the things he did, and two black women stepped out front and said, man, y'all, why are y'all scared of this dude? We're getting ready to get him together. So fraud charges New York, Georgia. Election. Ugh. And now they tried it. They literally tried this with the district attorney in New York. Then stick. But this, it sounded like it was gone when I heard it. I'm like, well, uh, well why would a co-defendant be talking about this? Because he knew the players involved. That's how. And you got to know you're being watched. How don't you? you going out the door like, man, everything already before this even happened. The minute you put your name forward, Listen, they was like, let's get it. 
Let me let's Google that. She see what we're doing. Right. See what's wow. going on with her. Well, I could just tell you, um, the great you man don't, Wheeler. You do not appoint your boo thing, special prosecutor, anything you're doing. You do not squat where you eat. Ain't nobody I've ever fucked working alongside me. <laughs> if it does not say Wheeler Advisory Group, and even then, <laughs> it's not going to happen. <laughs> it's not going to happen. <laughs> Could, couldn't have said any better. The great man Wheeler is back. Sorry. <laughs> no and uh, don't forget, <laughs> oh um, the great Leah Wheeler. This is a show that triggers people. This is a show that triggers people. I'm triggered today. To expose other points of view. Tune out now. Don't read the comments. Me. You have been I'm warned. And um, if you go down, go down swinging. Go down swinging. <laughs> oh you just God. might score a knockout. Missed you guys. Rumble, young man, woman, and community. Rumble. Rumble. I probably need to come on the last Wednesday of the month. <laughs>